आदरणीय प्रिंसिपल सर सुपरवाइजिंग हेड एवं मेरे सहयोगी पर जीवी पब्लिक स्कूल साहिबाबाद गणतंत्र दिवस की पावन बेला में अपने संरक्षक वर्ग अभिभावकों एवं विद्यार्थियों को हार्दिक शुभकामनाएं देता है तथा उनका अभिवंदन करता है अखंड भारत के 75 वर्ष अद्भुत अनुपम अतुल्य ओजस्व पर्व के पचहत्तर विजय अर्थ से अभिवंदन करता यह देश आज आजादी का अमृत महोत्सव मना रहा है और अपने गुमनाम क्रांति वीरों को स्मरणांजलि प्रदान कर रहा है आज का स्वयं सूर्य उन अनेक क्रांति वीरों और सेनानियों की मौन मुख शहादत की शौर्य गाथा का प्रतीक है जिन्होंने रक्तिम केसर से भारत माँ की चूनत केसरिया और धानी रंग में रंग ली आज के इस पुण्य पर्व पर देश की सरहद के निगाह बानों को सलाम करते हुए युवा शक्ति आप सभी का अभिवंदन करती है खुश नसीब है जो वतन पर कुर्बान हो गए खुश नसीब है जो वतन पर कुर्बान हो गए तिरंगे में लिपट कर सुपुर्दे खाक हो गए मरकर भी अमर हो गए वो जो शहीद होकर शहादत का नाम करते country our motherland we will together write your name on the golden sands of time warm greetings to all of you let us today stand united as we celebrate the 73rd republic day and we extend our heartiest welcome to all of you an eminent visionary and notable educationist with an enthralling persona the president of dav cmc and arya pradeshik pratinidhi sabha new delhi padma shri arya ratan dr poonam suri ji has made a mark in the sands of time as the voice of dav dedicated towards the quest of excellence on behalf of dav public school saibabad we extend a hearty welcome and invoke the stellar munificence and omniscient blessings of our revered president sir and forge ahead towards unforeseen future challenges in the trail of our institution's glory the distinguished luminary dr a k sharma ji embodies an ideal for dav with his fervent insightfulness and magnanimous persona the veteran's philanthropic vision has steered the venture of many educational pursuits we extend a warm welcome and beseech the benevolent blessings of our revered chairman sir in all our endeavors a man of distinct vision and fountain head of illuminating ideas shri j k kapoor ji our vice chairman sir is the guiding force and spearhead behind the glory of our school we feel elated to begin our republic day celebrations with his benign blessings a illustrious manager of our school and guiding light shri r k sethi ji with his towering personality keen intellect and impressive administrative acumen stands as the stirring soul behind our throbbing institution we acknowledge his staunch ideals and extend a hearty welcome and seek his blessings for a successful celebration of our festival today kisi bhi desh ka swadhiman hai un nadiranga bharat ka maan sukh samriddhi शांति और विश्वास का द्योतक है मैं अनुरोध करती हूँ माननीय प्रिंसिपल सर श्री वी के चोपड़ा जी से कि कृपया आज के समारोह में ध्वजारोहण कर समारोह का शुभारंभ करें। 
This will be followed by the national anthem and I urge you all to feel the dry color in your heart. जनगण मन अधिनायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता पंजाब सिंध गुजरात मराठा द्राविड उत्कल बंगा विंध्य हिमाचल यमुना गंगा उच्चल जलधि तरंगा तव शुभ नामे जागे तव शुभ आशीष मागे गाहे तव जय गाथा जन गण मंगल दायक जय हे भारत भाग्य विधाता जय हे जय हे जय हे जय 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 हे sprinkling colors of pride and patriotism for the country let us pledge today to dedicate ourselves towards the country's progress the public day marks an important event in india's history it commemorates the enactment of the constitution of india which came into effect on january 26 1950 and made the nation into a republic i now request our honorable principal sir shri vk chopra ji to address us on this historic day of our nation happy greetings all of you as we celebrate the country from hundred to seventy five years of progressive india and the 73rd republic day of nation The Republic Day marks an important event in Indian history. It commemorates the enactment of the Constitution of India, which came into effect on 26 January 1950 and made the nation into a republic. Today, as we celebrate our national festival together, let us all remember and pay tribute to our national icons. and hundreds of unsung heroes for their important contribution to this country as patriotic citizens it is our duty to always remember and teach our children that our diversity is our greatest strength and we should proudly stand united as a nation even when we face infinite difficulties and global problems Our India can be transformed into a strong and flourishing nation only with our united efforts and initiative. For which we need to prepare our children before it. Let us together understand and modify the foundation of this great republic today. The restoration and liberty. Our young generation need to realize that waking up every day. and the peaceful nation is not easy as it may seem to we all need to be proud of our peaceful atmosphere of the nation to be a free nation to this doesn't just mean liberty from the british but with the global changing scenario it has been a role to play like overcoming oppression discrimination exploitation hatred stress and the pandemic like situation our ancestors gave us a glorious past we need to create it in this republic day need to change and become a reality let us all realize the importance of this festival and united we will work towards a golden prospect for the india jai hind thank you sir your words have given us food for thought to strengthen ourselves as future pillars of the motherland 
Republic Day signifies the right spirit of independence and individual India. We today also salute the undaunting spirit of the freedom fighters who laid down their lives to make this day a dream come true for all of us. To give words to my feelings, we here have with us Avantika Shukla of Class 4I with a speech to mark the occasion. Freedom in mind, faith in our heart, memories in our souls. Let's salute nation on Republic Day. A very warm good morning to everyone. Respected principal sir, teachers, parents and my dear friends. I welcome you all to this great morning. Today, we have gathered here to celebrate the historic moment when our nation became an independent republic country. On the same day, 26 January in 1950, our own constitution came into existence. The constitution is the supreme law of India. It is a document which describes the rights and the duties of its citizens and the way in which it is governed. Friends, do you know? The father of Indian constitution, Dr. B. R. Ambedkar had studied the constitution of 16 countries and put an enormous amount of effort to draft the Indian constitution. Our constitution is the longest one in the world. It took around 2 years, 11 months and 18 days to complete it. It has 395 articles divided into 22 parts and 12 schedules. Till now, 105 amendments have been made in it. It is also known as Holy Book of Sovereign Democratic Republic of India. Since 1857, India has produced many great men and women who have sacrificed and dedicated their lives to give us this independent nation. As we are celebrating 73rd Republic Day, let's salute all these great Indians and promise to preserve our legacy. My dear friends, our forefathers have gifted us such a wonderful place where we can flourish freely. Now it is time to show our skills and capabilities. We have to create a new India overcoming all the challenges. Remembering the words of Dr. Abdul Kalam, let's have courage to give, courage to think different, courage to invent, courage to discover impossible, courage to remove pain, courage to combat problems and change the India of our dreams into a reality. Wish you a very, very purposeful and happy Republic Day. Jai Hind! Thank you, Avantika. Republic, what a wonderful word. A term that deals with the most significant events of our motherland. On this day, let us remember and pay tribute to some of our national icons. The father of the nation, Mahatma Gandhi, Dr. Rajendra Prasad, Sardar Vallam Bhai Patel, Pandit Jawaharlal Nehru, Baba Sahib, B. R. Ambedkar, Malana Azad, Govind Vallabhpan, K. M. Munshi, and hundreds of unsung heroes for their important contributions to the Republic. To commemorate this occasion, our little fledglings of class 2, dressed as our nation's icons, will now rock the stage, dedicating this day to them. The enthusiasts are a third of class 2C as Dala Lajpat Rai, Kriyansh of class 2C as Captain Vikram Bhatra, Tavishi Kaul of class 2B as Rani Lakshmi Bai, Sarvik Badula of class 2H as General Bipin Rawat, Hitansh of class 2D.
of Chansey, the last drop of my blood. If defeated and killed on the field of battle, we shall surely earn eternal glory and salvation. I am Rani Lakshmi by Queen of Jhansi. जब बेटी उठ खड़ी होती है तभी विजय बड़ी होती है हर हर महादेव चमक कुटी सन सत्तावन की वो तलवार पुरानी थी बुंदेलो हर बोलो के मुंह हमने सुनी कहानी थी खूब लड़ी वो मर्दानी वो तो झांसी वाली रानी थी हर हर महादेव we were always tough for defending our borders and when you have
26 जनवरी को वो जश्न और उत्सव मनाते हैं क्या सही अर्थों में हम अपना कर्तव्य पूरा कर पाते हैं झाकिया निकाल लेने से हर्ष प्रकट कर लेने से या इस दिन के महत्व को हम पूरी तरह जान पाते हैं हम बच्चे हैं हम देश की सीमा पर जाकर देश के दुश्मनों से लड़ नहीं सकते लेकिन हाँ कुछ ऐसे काम है जो हम कर सकते हैं जैसे पर्यावरण को साफ और सुंदर बनाने में अपना योगदान दे सकते हैं दिवस पर एक या दो पौधे लगाकर उनके परिवार के सदस्य जैसी देखभाल कर कर इस पृथ्वी को सुंदर बना सकते हैं महात्मा गांधी जी ने हमें साफ सफाई के साथ रहने की राह दिखाई थी एक स्वस्थ समाज ही एक सशक्त देश का आधार है यह बात बताई थी हम सब मिलकर अपने घर या स्कूल के आसपास एक सफाई अभियान चला सकते हैं लोगों को धुगी न फैलाने और सफाई रखने के फायदे बता सकते हैं अगर हम हमारे माता पिता के साथ कहीं बाहर जाते हैं तो अपने अभिभावकों को अपने यातायात के नियमों का पालन करने के लिए कह सकते हैं अगर हमारे आस पास घर में कोई बड़े बुजुर्ग है तो उनके मान सम्मान का ध्यान रख सकते हैं और उनके साथ खुशी के पल बता सकते हैं तो आइए गणतंत्र दिवस के अवसर पर हम सब मिलकर ये प्रण लेते हैं कि हम हमारे देश की एकता अखंडता और संप्रभुता को बनाए रखेंगे अपने अधिकारों की रक्षा के लिए अपने कर्तव्य का निर्वहन करेंगे आप सभी श्रोताओं का धन्यवाद जय हिंद जय भारत प्रेरक शब्द सदा सदा हमारे देश के युवाओं को साहस और पराक्रम की प्रेरणा देते रहे जलाने वाले जलाते ही हैं जरा आखिर जलाने वाले जलाते ही हैं जरा आखिर ये क्या कहा कि हवा तेज है जमाने की आज हमारा संकल्प हो इस चिराग को सदैव रोशन रखे जिसकी आभा से युवा वर्ग को देश के गौरव काल में नूतन अध्याय जोड़ने का अवसर प्राप्त प्रस्तुत है राष्ट्र को नमन करते हुए एक्शन
Education means allowing imagination to flourish and not be afraid to try new things. Sometimes new things fail, but it's awesome when they are a success. So today we are going to talk about best practices of upper primary wing that we tried in this session and with the right planning, perseverant attitude and efforts, these became our accomplishment too. First one is Sparkling Saturdays. As the name suggests, these are the classes that we plan specially for Saturdays. They are made sparkling like a twinkle in a child's eye. Sparkling Saturdays are introduced to create creative, fun learning space without the usual academic pressure. Here, teachers plan, design, interesting, creative but a learning focused activities like knowing oneself more.
STEM activities. activities. Our next best practice is create and connect to have better understanding of the content. Like social science teachers took two main characters from the first chapter and continued in further chapters. Our science teachers went a notch higher by replacing old monotonous diagrams with fun and interesting activities. And math subject, which everyone is afraid of due to lack of clarity in concept, but not anymore. Have a look at the fantabulous activities that our teachers design to teach angles, multiplications, division to proceed from unknown to known territories. We are not stopping here as innovative practices means continuously improving existing practices and changing the way we achieve goals. After the glimpses of the best practices, we now bring before you a beautiful English poem by Atulia Anand of class 6 death as he recites the poem, India earned its freedom to convey his thoughts on this day. Greetings to the Honorable Principal Sir, respected mentors and my dear school fellows. Today, I, Tulyanan of class 6, would like to recite a poem titled, India earned its freedom. India earned its freedom with non-violence and wisdom. The journey was not easy. It was full of difficulty and misery. People were divided, many communities were misguided. The years passed by, but the families were still in grief and sadness. Finally, people overcame the past and came together from every caste. All emerged as one to shine as bright as the sun. We walked towards the path of development and did things for India's betterment. We fought many fights, both at land and at heights. Today, the day has come when we play anthem with the drums. Now nobody can harm as we are technologically sound. Let the flag rise high with pride and celebrate the rights that were earlier denied and pay to pride. Thank you very much. Beautiful presentation of thought. One nation, one vision, one identity. मेरी पहचान मेरा भारत अनुभव बनवाए देखी सफरा जहां पहुंच अनजान स्थिति को मिलता है उत्साह ये भारत वह है जो कुटुंबता की भावना से उत्प्रोत ये अतुल्य देश देविका मेनेज के शब्दों में वंदे मातर Zara, come here, but I'll be there.
जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी है मेरे वतन के लोगों जरा आँख में भर लो पानी जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी जब देश में थी दीवाली वो खेल रहे थे होली जब हम बैठे थे घरों में जब जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी जो खून गिरा पर वो खून था हिंदुस्तान जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी तुम भूल न जाओ उनकी इसलिए कहीं कहाँ जो शहीद हुए हैं उनकी सरायात करो कुर्बानी जय
धन्यवाद देविका इस समय अद्भुत प्रस्तुति भारत अनोखा देश है ये आज नहीं ये शास्त्र सत्य और सिद्ध है क्योंकि विविधता में एकता भरे भौगोलिक राजनीतिक सामाजिक धार्मिक भाषा और जन के प्रविधि से परिपूर्ण भारत अनोखा राज है शिषा चक्रवर्ती लेकर आ रही है भारत की अद्भुत परिधि में घिरे हुए इस प्रकट प्रकृति को अद्भुत सौंदर्य को और अद्भुत संकल्प को जो हमारी युवा शक्ति अपने कृत संकल्प होकर इस देश की उन्नत गाथाओं में निहित करती है प्रस्तुत है त्रिषा चक्रवर्ती
We also celebrated World Environment Day in order to spread awareness about the threat to the environment owing to rising pollution and climate change. Earth Day was also celebrated, the day that marks the celebration of environmental movements and raises awareness about how to maintain a clean habitat. Celebrating a mother own to celebrating her own mother. We did it all friends. We made cards, wrote speeches to show how much we love our mothers on Mother's Day. The avians realized the importance of fitness very well. That's why we also celebrated ancient Indian art of healthy living. We also celebrated International Yoga Day and World Health Day. Paying our respects and expressing our gratitude towards our honorable gurus, we also celebrated Guru Purnima. We as aware citizens of India also celebrated World Population Day which aims at increasing people's awareness at various population related issues. Weekend Day celebration was also observed recently where we made posters, wrote creative speeches and also made beautiful creative vegetable masks. All of this was done in order to embrace an all green diet. Vami Shraddhanan Balidan Divas was also celebrated in a form of a special assembly to spread awareness about his journey. Maths Week was also celebrated elucidating the wonders of mathematics and how it has been present in our environment since forever. A state level painting competition was also organized under the National Campaign on Energy Conservation 2021 by Ministry of Power. Human Rights Day celebration was also observed to acknowledge the empowering principles in Universal Declaration of Human Rights. There was also a postcard activity in order to revive the importance of writing postcards under Azadi Ka Amrit Mahotsav, in which students wrote postcards to our Honorable Prime Minister. These activities were just to name a few, since we as one Devi family have lived each day as a celebration together. After this beautiful presentation by Disha Chakravarti, let us commence with our program. India became a sovereign democratic republic after its constitution came into effect. Our leaders gave us the gift of this glorious day. It is now our turn to make a strong and progressive India. We now bring before you a presentation on a few emerging change makers of the nation presented by the senior secondary wing of the school. In our culture, when adults bless our young ones, they give a certain amount of money plus one rupee extra, like 101 rupee, 201 rupee. They say, here a hundred rupee, I'm giving it to you. Next one rupee is to start something new. Because every achievement starts with one step. If you don't start, how will you end? For our whole team, it wasn't an easy task for everyone. But all we have done is believed in ourselves that after certain days, we will gather as much amount of funds, we will be able to serve the society. We cannot serve everyone out there. All we can do is to target the maximum number of people. That is the motive of our whole organization, to target maximum number of people. What makes this organization even more closer to my heart is that we never gave up. We believed in success and that too we have achieved within a span of 8 to 9 months with 500 plus Instagram followers, reach being so much increased and targeting group of 500 people and providing them food items, stationery and winter clothes even. So this is a small contribution by me towards the society. I hope it will change the condition of poor people. The secret of the chain is to focus all your energy, not on fighting the old, but on building the new. Hello everyone, I, Rishika Bhatt of Class 11B is here to introduce you all to a change maker who begins a ripple effect that may change the world and the people that thrive in it. Sanjana Kasana. Sanjana Kasana is presently serving as the Judicial Officer at Buland Shahid, District of Uttar Pradesh. She completed her high school from the DAV in the year 2012, pursuing the commerce subject. Did her graduation from an esteemed institute 
Shriram College of Commerce, Delhi University, then completed her LLB from Campus Law Center, DU, in 2018. After the LLB, she went for the PCSD exam and cleared it in the first shot. Not only being an inspirational woman, she is also the one who has the courage and determination to bring the change in the society we live in. Thank you. Personality begins where comparison leaves off. Be unique, be memorable, be proud, be confident. So, today my topic is Great Personality of India and I am going to talk about Manushi Chiller. Manushi Chiller is an Indian actress, model and Miss World 2017 pageant winner. She represented Haryana at Femina Miss India 2017 in which she won. She is the sixth representative from India to win the title of Miss World. She became role model for many girls out of which I am also one. Thank you. I have a passion and run for it. An amazing message by DAV for all the DAV novels. Hey everyone, this is Judy and today I am going to highlight the sparkling star of DAV Cyberbath family 1992 batch, Mr. Mayur Maheshwari, who is an IIT and cracked UPSC, worked in PM office and currently he is designated as a CEO in UPSC. India's former president, Dr. Kalam, also presented the award of Best Electoral Practice to Mr. Maheshwar. This rising star has a simple rule of keep learning even after achieving great mastery. He has illuminated the name of our school and this country by his work. Art is a beautiful form of expressing our thoughts and feelings. We now bring before you a presentation of the artists of the school depicting their feelings on this occasion today. Of Makar Sankranti, 
the Indian Ministry of Ayush organized the worldwide Surya Namaskar demonstration program for nearly 75 lakh people on January 14. Going with the initiative, TV Public School Cyberbars presents to you a similar initiative of yoga for fitness. Shit, the love, shit. 
तिरंगा हमारा अपना है दिल ये आज का दुनिया से जाके बोल दो बोल दो ऐसे जागो रे साथियों दुनिया की आंखें खोल दो खोल दो ओ हाथ धर के बैठने से क्या भला कुछ होता है वतन हमारा ऐसा कोई ना छोड़ पाए रिश्ता हमारा ऐसा कोई ना तोड़ पाए दिल एक है एक है जान हमारी हिंदुस्तान हमारा है हम इसकी शान हैं आजादी की कभी शाम नहीं होने देंगे शहीदों की कुर्बानी बदनाम नहीं होने देंगे बचे हो जो एक बूंद भी लहू की तब तक भारत माता का आंचल नीलाम नहीं होने देंगे टू कमेमोरेट सेवेंटी थर्ड रिपब्लिक डे आर स्कूल ऑर्केस्ट्रेटेड अ मेगा क्विज फॉर स्टूडेंट हु पार्टिसिपेटेड विद रीलर्स एंथुसियाज आई फील प्राउड टू अनाउंस द रिजल्ट ऑफ द क्विज टूडे
Then we're